This is the third style of vented pilot chute. This is what's called a ring vented pilot chute. The most common ring vented pilot chutes on the market today are toxic pilot chutes made by Asylum Designs in Northern California, but other manufacturers offer them well, as well, including Bad Seed and Squirrel. A ring vent is placed further out away from the apex, so it's not in the center of the pilot chute, but rather out towards the skirt, and looks like a ring uh, around the pilot chute itself rather than a hole in the center. The ring vent has advantages and disadvantages compared to other pilot chutes. The ring vent is certainly more expensive to manufacture, and usually you'll pay a premium for these pilot chutes. But the ring vent improves the stability of the pilot chute even beyond the apex vent and improves the hesitation rate dramatically over the apex vent, roughly with the same hesitation rate as an unvented pilot chute. When we compare the stability of different pilot chutes, the differences are noticeable. The unvented pilot chute is definitely the least stable, that's the black line in this diagram, with wide oscillations and a long oscillation time span. The apex vented pilot chute substantially improves that with a much shorter oscillation time span and much narrower oscillations. The ring vent is even more efficient, giving the pilot chute even less oscillation and even shorter time span, but the apex vent and the ring vent are a lot more comparable than either is to the unvented. So the improvement from unvented to vented of any kind is rather large. The improvement from apex vented to ring vented is substantially less. In terms of hesitation rate, the ring vent offers an improvement to the apex vent. The reason for this is that during the inflation process, air flows up, impacts the top skin of the pilot chute, and then expands out. The ring vented pilot chute has a vent that sits at the very bottom, the last point to fill, and during the inflation sequence is very unlikely to vent additional air. Compare that with the apex vented pilot chute, which could vent air directly through the top skin during inflation, and you can see why the ring vented pilot chute has a hesitation rate comparable to an unvented pilot chute, while at the same time, at the same time, gaining the stability advantages of venting. Comparing unvented, apex vented, and ring vented pilot chutes, the pull force, which is the most important factor, is basically going to be the same in all three configurations. With the ring vent, we see the best stability because the vent is at the highest pressure zone on the top skin of the pilot chute, and a fairly low hesitation rate. The apex vent has good stability, dramatically improved over the unvented pilot chute, but an increased hesitation rate with its vent at the apex allowing some outflow of air during inflation. The unvented pilot chute has the very best hesitation rate, meaning it experiences the fewest hesitations with good pull force, but has the least stability, encounters the most oscillations, and the widest time range of oscillations during the deployment.